Hi folks, and welcome back for part 31 of Let's Play Discworld 2. If you recall, we're talking to a hermit. So this friend of yours? Oh, Angus? Angus, it's for you! If you want Angus, you should have rung the second bell. It's clearly marked this on the door. Now just look, a I'm not little here to talk off. To oh, don't keep Angus waiting. He's a busy man. Biz, 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 busy? Busy man. What does he do? If it wasn't for him, I think I'd go insane. I think you have. Well, I'll tell you what. You just let him get on, and I'll come back later at a better time. You have gone insane. So you're... you're good then, are you? I mean, you know, wise wise. Wise? Wise? If I was any wiser, I'd be a leopard skin bikini. That wise, eh? Nya ha uh -huh. I'm so wise that I will now provide you with your heart's desire. A jingle. Written for your sinful modern type clicky film. He's good. Although I'm not sure I want the paper now that I know where he's gotten it from. Yes, 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 yes. No, Angus, no. No, not now, thank you, I'm busy. Mm, baste it for 12 minutes, 12. Fool, 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 and fool again. How can you never remember? Nyaha, there. Here's a jingle written expressly for your clicky project to promote the death. Oh, promote the death. What? You've written it for me now? Just like that? No quests or anything? Wonderful. Thank you. Thank you very much. You, you, you're, you're, you're most welcome. So can I have it? No. Ah, oh, darn it. I might have known. There's going to be a quest after all, isn't there? Not for me, but for Angus. He says he's sick and tired of being woken up all hours in the night by people coming here and asking us the riddle that has baffled philosophers since the dawn of time. Why? 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 Why what? Why anything? Why everything? Why are we here? Why are you here? Why am I here? Now that's a hard one. Right then. It's not like you're asking me to do anything difficult. Why? That's the question, okay? No problem. Right. Well, I'll just go off and find this answer for your invisible friend Angus, shall I? Is that fine by everybody? Right? Good. Well, here I go. Good old Rincewind, there's nothing better to do than trudge all over the disc, fetching one bloody thing after another. Right. Hmm. Now, where we? Where need are an we? answer oh, to yes. Dealer probably takes two. the hardest question of all time. Why? Well, hmm. Maybe the machine that we fix can help out with that. Maybe. I'd like to think so. I wonder... I wonder if Hex can do it now. I wonder if Hex is fixed. Yep. Yeah. I wonder if he's fully fixed. I mean, I know we loaded him back up with ants, but... He's a machine. He can answer these hard problems for us, can't he? Right. So the ants are in? Yes, that is correct. Oh, look. They are all running around. They're, you know... Keen to get started. Great. Yeah, anyway, so we are now ready to get going. I mean, I can ask this machine a question now. Yes, quite right. Ask, you know, ask away. What do you call this machine again? Hex. A three-letter name. And it's not because it's, you know, useless. No matter what you might hear people say. <laughs> 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 lovely. See anything wrong with the name at all? No. My research assistant seemed to think it's very appropriate. All right, all right. Let's just get on with it then, shall we? Right. Hex, I want you to tell me the answer to the question, why? Well? Ah. Well, of course, a certain amount of working time is required for any problem of this type. Okay. Yeah? How long? According to my estimate, we should have your answer in a jiffy. A jiffy? Ah, that is the abbreviation of the Clatchian word jiffacitra, meaning eon or age of the world. Probably about two million years. 
You don't have two million years. Would you years. like a cup of something while you wait? Him look. Oh, I don't know if we have any of that in stock. Luke, there's no point in getting up tight. You'll just have to be patient. I mean, it's not as if you can just run off and somehow accelerate time. Oh yeah, you're well, sure I'm about a that? Wizard. A bony fidey pointy added skirt wearing magic tosser. Although perhaps I should rephrase that. <laughs> I can do anything I like. I'll accelerate time anywhere I want to, any when, any how. I'm going to accelerate time for those little six-legged idiots in there. Let them develop a civilization, new philosophies, and entire galaxies of new perceptions. And then I'm going to jump up and down on the lot of them. Hey, I'm really getting the hang of this science business, aren't I? Hmm. Well, let's. Since we're here, I want to take a look at that some more. Let's see if it says anything. Plans on how to make a model pyramid. Useful stuff if you ever need to start a hmm. business sharpening razor blades. Well, shall we go talk to the pyramid maker again? Or the pyramid designer? I think so. Considering we know that this, we can use that to, uh... Come on. We can, we can design a pyramid to accelerate time. So, let's do it. Come on, to jelly baby, again. Doing all this for a song, folks. Hey. Lo, behold the majesty of this tall stone pointy thing. Who knows its mystic secrets? Who cares? Not me, for one. Well, let's go back this way. Pyramid so popular. Well, time. Yeah. You so then when they the hopefully. And does anyone ever figure out? No. But there, ah, I have a terrific design here for a reverse pyramid. One for okay. accelerating time. It's a great. I can age wine in a second. But do you think I can get the funds or equipment to build it? Ah, no. It's always design a maze to call that a. Okay, so he had the design, right? A chart of a pyramid. Gad, now there's a pointed clue. I wonder if these things really do change the speed of passing time. Well, that design we took, I, he was talking about this one Plans right on how useful stuff. You now, we don't really, do we have anything that we can use to make a pyramid? We do now, folks. Uh, this is a somewhat leap of faith logic because they don't, you know, give you enough hints to go step by step on it. But basically, you take your bits of straightened wire and use them with the plans. The scale model pyramid. And Perfect for keeping voila. scale model mummies fresh. What we have is a pyramid that will accelerate the flow of time. I came all this way out for, well, no real reason, except to just kind of reinforce that the design that we took off of his wall was indeed one that accelerated time. I know it doesn't come right out and say that, but still. So, <laughs> oh, just about time to cut the video. When we come back, there's the beat. When we come back, we will use the pyramid to make Hex work really, really fast, get our answer, and give it to the insane wise hermit dude. So, until then, take care, everybody. See you later.